What has been your most memorable part of rehearsal so far? I enjoy being included in what the kids are doing. They're like, can you play this thing with us? And sometimes it's like, oh no, I gotta do this like director thing. And other times I'm like, yeah, you wanna play a game? Cool. What makes your rendition of Romeo and Juliet unique? Romeo and Juliet are both played by ladies as ladies. All positive feedback about that. Um, which I'm excited about because especially kids seeing people that resemble them on stage makes them so much more comfortable with who they are. Creating a space for them to be proud of who they are is something that's important to me. My favorite memory is probably just all of us getting closer together with the games and how silly we're acting. Having like fun with my friends. The prince, which is supposed to be the serious character in the entire play, giggling at everything. Um, probably the sword. <laughs> getting to like practice the sword scenes because those are those are a lot of fun. Yeah. My mom and dad for driving me and my sister every night, <laughs> and Kate for allowing us to be able to audition this week. To thank my family for being so open and willing for me to play this role, and for supporting me through that, and just also thanking Kate over here. <laughs> both Kates! Both Kates! Kate, <laughs> Juliet, director Kate, I want to thank you for being an amazing director! I thank Amelie, who is playing Romeo it's for so being like okay with everything and just so amazing. <laughs> my little sister and my mom for helping me out remembering. 